Hi, I'm Debbie with Scientific Industries, and I'm here today to introduce you to some of our additional Vortex Genie equipment. Many of you already know the infamous Vortex Genie 2, but for those of you who need to do larger capacity and larger volume as well, you can do that with our other Vortex mixing products. Here we have the Multi Vortex Genie and we have the Vortex Genie Max. The primary difference between these are the diameter of the orbit and the speed at which they can maximize. So depending upon the application and requirements, that's how you choose which one would be best for you. That being said, the Multi Vortex Genie, you can control the speed and the time. In the Vortex Genie Max, you can control speed, time, but you also can program. The additional programming capabilities would be your pulse, which is an on-off for total cycle time. And we also have reverse mode, so that you can go clockwise vortexing and then counterclockwise allowing for a more vigorous mix, a homogeneous mix. We also have uh, on it just normal run for total time. So that being said, let's take a look at these. So right now I have these set up with flasks and 50 ml tubes and some larger capacity open top tubes. One of the nice things with these Vortex mixers is also the ability to work with open containers. Some of you may be familiar with some of the other Vortexing uh, equipment out there that has a plate that comes down, does not allow you to work with open containers. With these units, you can work with open containers. So, let's turn these on. So, press it to engage. Time, let's set the time for three, four minutes. Maximum speed at 1,000 RPM. We'll turn that on. The ramp rate is set specifically so that the vortexing, the, the volume and the vortex comes up to a very nice vortex. So you'll see some hesitation and that's deliberate to get the material moving in the proper motion. All right, so if we turn this off, to load and unload, very simple design, it's spring-loaded. Load it back up, just it's spring-loaded bar. Make sure your bars are tight. Always check your tubes for secure, so you don't want to pop it out as it's vortexing. And run it, just hit run. Set your speed and your time, start, and we let it go. Another nice feature with the Multi Vortex Genie Max, the uh, Multi Vortex Genie, is that you can adjust the height. So depending upon the height of your container, it allows you to adjust. So a lot of flexibility with that. Now we have the Vortex Genie Max. The Vortex Genie Max will go to 2,000 RPM. So we have 1,000 RPM versus 2,000 RPM. Four millimeter diameter orbit versus a two millimeter diameter orbit. So it's a tinier orbit. So let's take a look. Right now I have the racks that are in here with various tube sizes for the uh, demonstration. Shows the versatility. But when we go to turn it on, right now we have it in normal mode, which is just run. Then we also have a function for reverse mode. And then we also have a pulse mode, which is an on or total cycle time or continuous. So. Let's take a look at it in the normal mode. We'll just turn it on. Maximum speed, we have happen to have it set at 2,000 RPM. And whether it be a smaller tube 
which is about a, a three mil, four mil tube. We have 15 ml tubes. We have some chemistry tubes, the glass tubes, and some 50 ml tubes. And each and every one of those, we're pulling a very nice vortex. I can change it to the reverse mode just by pressing the mode button. So let's just hit the start button. So you're gonna be going clockwise, your sample will be mixed clockwise and then counterclockwise. So one of the benefits of going in reverse mode is to keep samples that may adhere to the sides or of the uh, containers or, or tubes. So it removes that so you get a nice homogeneous mix of your sample. Then we also have the pulse mode. Vortex Genie Pulse or the Digital Microplate Genie, that's a function that uh, scientific industries has been utilizing in a number of pieces of equipment, allowing for on and rest mode for total cycle time. When we do that, we're going to press the mode button to light up where it says pulse. And we have it currently set for four seconds on, four seconds off and we'll hit start. Once again, the benefit of the on-off feature is dependent upon your application. So if you need to get sample into a homogeneous mix, going on, bringing it up to a vortex, and then letting it drop down and rest, it's gonna break up that material, pulling it into a very nice homogeneous mix. Then we also, in addition to that, have other capabilities. So we have the programming mode here, but we have the ability to vortex your plates, deep well or standard. And it's very simple by just removing the rack, the ratcheting uh, rack. Set the rack aside. These are foam inserts that are sold as accessories. Place them into or onto the platform. Lock that in. And this can handle up to four plates with two foam inserts. So if you need to get a homogeneous mix well to well with a two millimeter orbit, you just set that. We're gonna put this in normal mode and just hit start. You get nice, even, well-to-well -well mixing, regardless of whether it's a deep well or a standard plate. If you have any questions about these products, you can reach out to us through our website, scientificindustries.com, and we'll be happy to assist you. Our products are available, are made in the USA, but they're available worldwide through our distribution partners.